They're strangling you. So it's not Frankenstein style strangulation from a, you know, they're pissed off. So if he was angry, how would you be strangling me if you were angry? Pretty much like that, okay? So, fucking hell. Sorry, I asked. Give me a second. Alright, so it's be <laughs> fucking hell. So he grabs me again. That was a good, good intensity. So if he comes in like this, my hands are here. Reflexively speaking, every human being, especially if the assault was sudden and explosive, is going to be doing this, especially with this crushing in. Now, strangulation takes a while. It could take 40 seconds, a minute, depending on the struggle, how deep the thrums are getting, how bad the individual is pushing, right? So it could take a bit. It could also be fast. But reflexively, most people's hands are going to come here and they're going to try to take those hands off. It's just a reflex reaction during a high stress situation where somebody is trying to kill you. Okay? It's not practicing in a martial arts school. Okay? We're not doing that. That doesn't work. Okay? Especially if somebody's trying to kill you. And they're not going to be standing like Chris is standing here. They're going to be pushing forward. So you're going to be going downwards. Or they're going to be on top of you and you're going to be on the ground. Right? So you're looking at that. You're not looking at, okay, do your move. It's very different when there's rage and emotion behind it. So as soon as, now, if you have, if I was, if the individual is following the principles that are taught prior to the contact stage and we're in a situation where they're being aggressed uh, uh, you know, and confronted, their hands are, should be up here. So if that double-handed strangulation come up, they literally should be going right in, striking, tearing, and ripping the moment they see, well, that. Because this is how a strangulation is going to start. The person's not going to be down here going, hey, how you doing? Having a good day? Boop. Okay? It's going to be like, Nuh. so if I want to strangle him and I'm really angry, this starts to happen. This. Okay? So the chest starts to flare out. The teeth are clenched. There's a lot of pre-contact indicators there. The hands are reaching. The shoulders are coming for everything is barreling through. You haven't gotten grabbed yet. Okay? So all this starts to happen. So if my hands are here and I see all this body language, this should be the response. Strike, rip, tear relentlessly. Let's say you were caught off guard. You froze for a second. Boom, he landed. Your hands came here and you went, oh my god, this isn't working. Right into the face, immediately, claw, gouge, tear, palm, rip, slam a forearm strike, a hammer fist, a palm strike, grab, Arr! chew, rip, hammer the head into the wall, anything, everything. There's no rules here. I gotta so he's trying to kill me. Okay? This is what's going on. He's trying to strangle me. So my response is feral and brutal, and I'm doing everything within my power to stop him from strangling me. If